Hi, I'm Liz Halliday. I'm an international three-day eventer, originally from America, but now I've been based in the UK for the last 10 years and I've competed to three-star level. Today I'm going to talk to you about selecting the right bit for your horse. Choosing the correct bit for your horse's needs can have a huge impact on their performance and also on the happiness of you and your horse. There are some standard types of bits that you will find that are most common. A snaffle bit is a single jointed bit, such as this. These can come in a loose ring, like this bit, or also in a fulmer, D-ring, or egg butt snaffle, generally. From there, you can have a French link snaffle, which has this lozenge in the middle. These can come as a rounder lozenge. There are many, many different varieties. Also in loose ring, fold cheek, and all the other side arrangements. Then we go to a straight bar or a mullen mouth snaffle. This particular one is flexible, but these come in all different types. This is particularly nice for a horse that doesn't accept the jointed bit of the snaffle. This is another bit that's also the flexi mouth, however it's in the snaffle form with the loose ring. This is also a very soft bit, similar to the others you'd find. As we move to the much stronger bits, we have a pelham bit here. This bit has a chin strap that's chain that acts underneath for leverage and also can be used with two reins for extra leverage or with a D-ring across to hold with one rein. This is quite a strong bit and also acts on the pole of the horse, which is not legal for dressage and is generally used for jumping with a horse that's quite strong. Another bit that I like a lot is a sweet iron bit. You can see it's a different color and it's a different type of metal coating on top. This helps a horse to salivate more, and many horses really like this, especially young horses. Here we just have some bit rings, which you can put on any sort of bit, especially a loose ring, where sometimes a horse can become pinched. These are very useful, and these particular ones actually have the cross sections in them to make them very easy to put on. This is only a very small range of all the many bits that are available, so the best is to consult a professional about what the right bit for your horse will be.